Alright, so this is going to be a tutorial for how to make greed from Full Metal Alchemist and Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Now, this isn't exact, this is in his um, form where he's basically invincible with a tough skin. Um, I just decided to do the outline of his face because I thought it looked good and it was a good use of layers and things like that. So, uh, we're going to go ahead and get started. <clears throat> so, first, just go ahead and make a background out of anything. Um, keep that white. Next, you're going to flag breeze, make that black, uh, rotate it, expand a little bit. So, make sure you get the curvature of his eye like that. Copy paste. Bring it, bring the other one over here. So you get something like that. Next we're going to go ahead and make the lines on his face. Uh, I made the right one out of, I didn't check what the name was, a tongue. So toggle outline, make it a little bit smaller and have that about right there. The other line was made out of a golf flag. Toggle outline, make it a little bit smaller, and have that about like that. Next you're going to want to get rid of the rest of that golf flag, just use any any old layer. I picked the lieutenant. Um, So that cleans up nice and easy. Next you're going to want to make the bottom of his face all black. Oh, it's a bad layer to use for it. Um, just get a round square, expand it, and make that black. Next we're going to start making the mouth, and what I did for that was I just got a rectangle medium, flip it sideways, put it down here, about like that, and just start making a bunch of layers around it to make it look like teeth, so you can get Anything with a corner on it, 90 degree corner will work. Make that black. Have that little indent right there. Copy paste. And just make a few of those. At the bottom, I used something specific actually. The. Oh, where is it? There it is. The scoop. Make that black. And have it kind of on the edge right here. Copy paste, flip it. Edge right there. And sort of. Have them have another two, kind of lining up with the uh, layers you made on the top. And next, you can just get another 90 degree corner and put that right there for the bottom. Now you're gonna make a golf flag. Toggle outline, make it a lot smaller, and have that little line that's sticking out be the in between lines for the teeth. So, like that, and flip it, and have one over here.
can also make it a little bit smaller and kind of smooth out the uh, edges of the teeth. Now for the center line, I just get a second lieutenant, rotate it horizontally, toggle outline, make it smaller, and just put that right there. Make that black. Uh, now you can get the half circle, and I'll show you this. I didn't realize that you could do this until just recently. You can uh, press the right stick in and then free scale it, which is pretty awesome in my opinion. So toggle outline and make that black. So you've got a line going across the center of the teeth. Now for the outside fangs, I just used the visors. Make sure the fangs are kind of pointing at the tips of the lines on his face, because that's what it looks like in the actual show slash manga. So once you get those, you're going to use the cone to round out the bottom. Like that. Copy paste, flip it, bring it over. And next I use the private first class to make the nose. It's a simple layer. So about like that. Now you're going to be left with six layers. Um, you can do pretty much whatever you want with these. Um, what I did for one of my emblems was I used just a lieutenant again, um, made it black, and just filled in the the eye areas where the lines come in so that it looks like the lines aren't just going through his eyes, they're going behind them. So you can bring those over. So you can do something like that. Or if you don't want to do that, I'll show you something else I did. With this emblem, I just made his name at the bottom. Greed, you can see there. So, alright, that's going to be it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to suggest new emblems. And, uh, yeah, have a good day.